Yesterday, Wizards announced they'll be updating the standard ban list on Monday, May 29th. While we don't yet know what, if anything, will be banned, so far the speculation's been focused on cards like Fable the Mirror Breaker and Shield or the Apocalypse. So should you be running out to sell these expensive cards now just in case they get banned? Not necessarily. The truth is that paper standard play is a relatively small part of the Magic ecosystem at the moment. Cards like the $25 Fable and $73 Shielded are expensive because they see play in multiple formats, with Fable being a staple in Pioneer and Modern, while Shielded sees Pioneer playing is quite popular in Commander. In the recent past, we've seen cards like the Meat Hook Massacre, which is still $40, and Oko Thief of Crowns, almost $20 despite being banned in essentially every 60 card format, maintain fairly high prices despite being banned in Standard. Cards like Fable and Shieldred are a safe bet to react the same way should they be banned. While their prices will probably drop, they're not going to drop to anywhere near zero, and they might maintain a lot more value than you expect just because they're so popular outside of Standard. 